So tonight I watched uh, a new movie called Jenny's Wedding, which was written and directed by Mary Agnes Donahue. She wrote Beaches. I love Beaches. Not only do I love Beaches, I have the Beaches soundtrack on vinyl, and I used to watch Beaches all the time in college and cry. And like, if Beaches was on TV, I would watch Beaches and not do whatever it was I was supposed to do, whether it was studying or hanging out with friends. I'd be like, sorry, Beaches is on. Beaches is a great movie. This movie is not as good as Beaches, unfortunately. It's not terrible, though. That sounds like damning with faint praise. It's not really damning with faint praise. I would say this is a, sort of like a movie whose heart is in the right place and who has some interesting things to say, but it doesn't all gel very well, and mostly because... The crux of the story is that Katherine Heigl's character is going to marry Alexis Bledel's character, and you need to give a damn about that. And I didn't, because their relationship was not well established, and as, you know, Alexis Bledel could have been anybody. Like, her character was like a prop instead of the love of this girl's life, and that made the whole movie sort of suck a little bit because it was like if this is gonna work and this is this is what we're rooting for we gotta care you know um but the other characters the characters that are sort of dealing with uh Jenny coming out and their feelings about being lied to and about being uh very conservative Catholics and not sure how they feel about homosexuality and specifically about um marriage that's not in the gender binary that they know they were interesting and that part of the film worked it's just a bummer that there was like no chemistry or history or anything with the you know lead and the love of her life like you know that sucks i particularly liked grace gummer who is meryl streep's daughter um i think she's her younger daughter like there's mammy and then there's grace i think I don't know. Um, she was very, very good as the sister who is in a shitty marriage and sort of unrealizing that she's in a shitty marriage and then in seeing her sister be happy realizes that her marriage is shitty and that gender dynamics are stupid and that um, she, she needs to kick her husband out. And that was good. I liked that. Um, and I liked that it caused everybody in the film to sort of reevaluate their ideas of what men should do and what women should do because in this situation it was two women and they were like, what? You know, like they couldn't fathom how it worked because they hadn't ever thought outside of the binary of men do this, women do that, men and women get together, so women do this and men do that. And it was, that was interesting and I wish they had sort of covered that a little more. Uh, Tom Wilkinson was great as the father and Linda Et Emmond was the mom. I'm not really sure that I'd seen her in anything before. She looks really familiar, but I feel like I haven't seen her in anything. I'm looking at her filmography. She was in Across the Universe for like a second. Um, and she was in Julie and Julia. That's what I recognize her from. Yeah. Yeah. She was in Julie and Julia. Um, she apparently mostly does theater. She was really, really good as the mom. And Katherine Heigl was good, um, especially when she gets to give, like, really passionate speeches. She's really good at that. She's always been good at that. Like, that first season of Grey's Anatomy, she's got a lot of passionate speeches. Um, I just wish there was some chemistry between the two women getting married. <laughs> like, it's, it's like, why are you getting married if you guys have no, there's no spark. Like, that, that was a bummer. And, um sort of brought the whole rest of the movie down a little bit. Um, otherwise, it was a good movie. So it's available on rent. I rented it on Amazon. It's in a few theaters. Um, I think IFC is releasing it. So it's in a handful of theaters, and then you can rent it on iTunes and Amazon, um, and probably elsewhere. I'm not sure. Uh, just came out this Friday. And again, it's written and directed by Mary Agnes Donahue who wrote Beaches, and I know that Beaches is not directed by a woman, but 
you should drop everything and watch Beaches because Beaches will make you cry. I was hoping this would make me cry the way Beaches makes me cry because I really needed like an ugly cry today and um, I did not get an ugly cry out of this movie, which is too bad. So that was Jenny's Wedding. It's from 2015 by Mary Agnes Donahue and stars Katherine Heigl. You should rent it.